I'm back. I feel like I've been on all day, but I haven't. So say hello when you pop in. If you see the red box above, that means I'm live. If you don't, that means you're just catching the replay, but that is totally fine. Um, let me move my mouse, pop open my video so I can say what's up to everybody. Oh, how's everybody Sunday? How are you guys doing? I'm going to open this. My volume is always on, guys, and I can't hear my voice like this. Hey, Monica. Oh, I hope I don't have crappy service, so let me know how you guys see me and how you hear me. Hopefully, you guys can see me okay. Where the heck is my mouse? All right. I will never get used to this setup forever and ever and ever. Hi, Cynthia. Hey, Leticia. Hey, Rebecca. Hey, Mindy. Hey, Jamie. Hey, Cheryl. Hey, Angela. Oh my gosh, guys. I have not been feeling well either. I totally feel you, Rebecca. So yesterday, the other day when I was live, I don't know if you guys could tell that I was like super weird. <laughs> I was like really down, I guess. I felt like I was really down. Um, I'm going to pin the keywords and stuff. Love watching you earlier today. I'm, I'm excited. Yay. So I just did an opportunity live for our team group and then I did a team training on the comp plan so I've been on all day guys hi thank you I, I took a shower today hold on I need my notes so just tell me about your day while I put, put this up keyword of today is going to be tag because we are going to do some double sided tags you guys what? hey joy hey Tina hi guys I know right oh shit I, I pinned your message Diane Hold on, you guys are moving too fast for me. So I don't know if you guys noticed, I really felt like off the other day. Like I felt completely off. And then and sure enough, I ended up having to go into bed. Last night, I, or yesterday I was in bed all day because I had like, I had like sinuses or something going on. Um, and so my entire family thought I had COVID and like nobody wanted to see us today. And I was like, I just had a sinus infection, I think. <laughs> I think because I feel better. All right. Um, I have been busy, huh? It's because I, I had a day off, guys, and I can't ever have do days off like that because it'll make me sick. It'll make me, like, worry that I'm not doing anything. Thank you, guys, for spreading the love. All right. Um, so we're going to do a couple of door tags. So these you can get in my shop. They are awesome. They are 9 by 12, so they are super big. We're going to do it to wear... We have Halloween, and then you flip it around, and you have fall, okay? So, obviously, we're going to have to do one accent. The other one will have the picture, or vice versa. So, we're going to have to do a little bit of thought process in here. I think I can do it, though. I think I can. All right. So, when you pop on, say hello. Remember, all you have to do is sh like and follow the page, share the video, and then comment the keyword tag to get into today's giveaway. Thank you guys who are all already doing that. Um, we're going to open these bad boys up. If I can find my scissors. Hey from Edmond, Oklahoma. What are you guys up to today? I know it's Sunday, so Sunday is like the day where everybody, where the hell, where everybody chills, right? Thanks, Miss Bethany. Hey, Judy. All right, so it, they do come wrapped, okay? But these are just like any of our, hi, Margo. These are just like any of our other surfaces, guys. So they're going to be really, really sturdy and good material. What's happening here? Okay. Hi, Sandra. Hey, Jamie. All right, so let's take these bad boys off. Paid my invoice. Awesome. So all paid invoices, guys, will be out um, probably, you guys should see my trunk. They have not been picking up my mail since Thursday and so I have like a trunk full of boxes but they'll be out this week or they'll be out within the day um hi Diane and then I have more bundles coming up in my VIP group so just make sure so these are solid wood guys hi Bethany had to turn on the heat today that's exciting I have the AC on no joke as you can tell it doesn't look like fall here right so I am wearing this shirt and I am also wearing shorts <laughs> so yeah Hello from Minnesota. Hi, Bethany. I'm going to take the wrapping off, and we are going to wax these, okay, um, because they are wood. Hi, Anna. So if you would like to hang these out outside, you're going to want to seal this. All my Halloween decorations out completed. My pool noodles. Awesome. Hi, Jane. Thank you, Judy. 
All right, so we're gonna we're gonna wax these bad boys first. Hey, Melinda. Hey, Terry. Um, Terry, did you catch the Opportunity Live today? I don't know if I changed it last minute because I wasn't feeling well yesterday. So I know a lot of people were waiting yesterday, and I just I don't know what happened. All right. So you guys, if you don't want to buy a big jar of this, you can buy this in my shop also. No, that means white yucky snow. <laughs> um, you can buy it in my shop under surface wax, which is going to do the same purpose. But I have this huge thing that I need to use, and I really like how it smells. So since this is like wood, we're gonna we're gonna wax it, okay? We're gonna wax both sides because we're gonna use both both sides. It's gotten cold. AC on here, right? I still have AC and shorts on, guys. It's so nice though in the evening. Oh, I love it. We have windows open 67. Ooh. Thanks, Marlene. I'm cold in PA. We've been out in the woods for two days tracking deer. Oh my gosh, no way. That's like something I would only see in the movies. I miss it. Can you rewatch? Of course. As long as you're in that group, you can rewatch it. If you're not, just send me a message and I'll tag you when I get off. So I just do a light coat of wax. I didn't know there was an opportunity live. Where do I look for them? Ashley, it's in the opportunity group. I, you should, you might be in there. Just send me a message and I'll tag you in it. So anybody that ever wants information, there's a video talking about all the benefits of signing up this month. All right. So super easy, lint free cloth, just throw on a wax, a thing of wax. Hi Veronica. Hey Brenda. You can see that it's on there a little glossy. I usually tell people follow the instructions. Um, follow the instructions that are on the jar. Um, this is Varathane wax, but there's minnow, minnow wax and there's also wax in my shop. So just depending on whether you don't want to go buy it and you want to just get it with the tags, whatever. But the instructions say, doo -doo -doo -doo, allow dry thoroughly 10 to 15 minutes. Okay, like 24 hours. Yeah, if you guys want to tag, just send me a message because I may not see it, but I will definitely tag you. And you may not be in the group either, so I'd have to add you to the group. So if you want information, just comment info, and that will actually give you the group there. Hey, Robin. Oh, Cecilia. Okay, comment mystery, and you'll get the info for that because I have not invoiced for those. You, Everybody has until next week. I wanted to give everybody ample enough time ample time I'm trying to use big words all right so just we're gonna wax these here I normally do not wait 10 to 15 minutes guys I don't know if it's because I'm very dangerous or what but I'm like well it is going it is doing the sole purpose of what I need it to do so I'm not really big on time frames but if you really do want to go by the book and wait then go for it of course. Yeah, you guys that request info, just make sure that you check your messenger and there's a message that I send you and click on that link and request that group. So that's how I kind of filter you guys in. I'll add you and then right away I will go and tag you in the video so you can see the information. Okay, so we're going to do these. I don't know that I'm going to try my shot. I'm blurry. Oh no, am I blurry for everybody? You guys, I have crap ass internet. I have two things of internet and it's still super duper crappy. So let me know if I think I refocused. It's cause you, what? <laughs> You're blurry and cutting off. Oh no. Okay. Hold on guys. Let me do something. It's cause you like to live on the edge, right? <laughs> okay, Cecilia, just make sure you write back. Um, Make sure you write back to that to that post. Hold on, guys, really quick. Write back to that post and tell me exactly which one you want. And then I will, of course, sign you up. Hold on, guys. I'm going to attempt to switch my internet and hope that we don't lose each other. But if we do, just know that I'll be right back. Just know that I'm not going anywhere. Okay, I just swapped internet. Let's see if this works. I hope that works, guys. In and out, not blurry, blurry can keep going out of focus. It's worse. It's because of my black shirt. Okay, let's hope that works. All right, um, so we're gonna plan out our, our door tags. So normally you would have one that is like an accent and your other that has the full picture. 
So you guys want to see Halloween or fall first? I feel like we'll do Halloween. Let's do Halloween because I've never done this one. So this is super cute for a pillow for, I don't know, if you, depending on how you guys like to decorate. I don't know that I would decorate a pillow for Halloween, but I will decorate a pillow for Christmas. Okay. If I'm lagging, guys, oh, shoot, I hope it does, I hope it gets better, but hopefully it reconnects and does a little better, but I think it's just my internet, guys, it's crap. I have two internet providers and they're both crap. All right, mine is better, much better, okay, awesome, thank you, I'm thinking of signing up, but I would like to try it first. Of course, it's like remix, you said down like two or three times, you said down, what? <laughs> um... Okay, yeah, Cecilia, so if you want to try, um, a good way to try it, guys, is the mystery bundles. Do the basic $25 one. It's perfect. It's going to be a small size project for you. Or in my VIP group, I'm actually posting, I just posted um, some fall bundles, and I just put it, posted some Halloween bundles, and I'll have more coming for you throughout the week. I don't have, like, a set time when I have them because I've just got to make sure that I have the inventory for them. What's happening? What's happening? Okay. I'm going to try to go out and come in to see if you catch up on your voice. Oh, am I behind? Oh, I'm sorry. It's my internet, guys. As I can't see myself anymore either. That sucks. Womp womp. Hold on, guys. Do you guys see me? Am I frozen? Looks like my computer's frozen now. Hold on. Oh, okay, I see it. Can you add me to the VIP group? Of course. Comment VIP, and then you'll get the link. Sarah, you can get these tags directly from my shop. Just comment shop. So my computer just completely caught up, so I hope that it caught, catches up for everybody else, because I don't know what the heck. So it's tag to get into the share giveaway, or into the giveaway for tonight. Comment the word tag. Um, all right. Comment the word tag, and then um, it's shop to get all the materials, and it's VIP to get into my VIP group to get all my deals. So this is a big transfer. Obviously, I don't need it this big. So I'm just going to use a portion of it. I was supposed to get all my paste out, and I didn't. It caught up? Okay, good. I don't know what happened, guys, but I'm going to use some printed colors here today. Okay. Yay, I'm glad we fixed it. I think we just broke the internet a tad. So I'm going to do some purple and some shimmer shadow for these, okay? So I'm not going to get too crazy with the colors, but I do like the shimmer. All right. So I'm just going to fuzz. I love your fur shirt. Thank you. This is fall in Texas for you. All right. I'm going to fuzz this. Even though I waxed it, I'm just going to fuzz it a bit. But the wax is going to protect the transfer from pulling up any... Um, any extra, this is the wrong side, any extra, like we want to protect this surface here, especially if you're layering, you want to wax. And this, my towel needs to be cleaned, but. Hi, Samantha. If you guys are new, let us know where you're watching from. I feel so much better to be live. I just was not feeling myself the last couple of days. Super weird. So like, if I didn't message you guys back or anything, it wasn't anything personal. I was just totally having an off moment. So I'm going to wrap this. Ooh, be careful because they will stick to themselves. You can usually get it off very carefully. Hey, Coral, when do you when do you wax a surface and not? So, general rule of thumb is you're going to wax anything that is wood. Um, I wax galvanized metal because these bad boys stick to it like crazy. Um, I wax galvanized metal. I even wax glass sometimes. No, I don't wax glass. Um, so, just to protect your surface below if it's wood and then also um let me move these and then also when you're layering so if you wanted to layer like the vintage truck for example you would want to wax over that bottom portion just to protect your paste below so if you've painted it with acrylic paint all that stuff welcome guys from california all right so i'm just going to put this in the center and obviously i want it to be somewhat straight this is going to be my, um, from Canada, Kansas. Hey, Tammy. This is going to be my accent tag. And the wax really keeps it from sticking like crazy to your surface. 
because you don't want it to stick really hard to where you can't pull it up. So I think for this one, I'm going to go ahead and do the purple. All right. Thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you. So tag, yeah, just comment tag to get entered into tonight's giveaway. And then you got to hang out till the end. I think I put too much wax, guys. Be going a little hard. Are the tags from your shop? Yes, ma'am. This transfer, that's a good question because I've never used it before. This transfer is called the Skull Damask. The price is that wrong. Pattern. But yeah, Diane, you can get these directly from my shop. And we're going to use Regal like we used with the crystal balls. We're going to use Regal today. At least for the accent. And you can do different colors, multicolors, however you want to do it. You know what I need to is some clean squeegees. What are we going to make today? Chris, we are making double-sided door hangers. Double-sided door hangers. So these are a big seller, guys, in the crafting world. People love door hangers. They love them. My door is a little strange. So my, there's no way I could hang these in my door. They would look stupid because my door is all glass with wrought iron. And it doesn't even, like, there's nowhere for me to hang it. And then if I were to hang it, it would look dumb. Like, it would be down here on the bottom. So it kind of sucks. Hey, Belinda. But my forever home, we're going to, we already have, like, we want two doors. And, yeah. Thanks, guys. Thank you, thank you for spreading the love. I'm just going to clean off this squeegee. I know. You would think I'd be prepared. Sometimes I want to move states, but I could never. Girl, don't leave. Don't ever leave there. Like, if. If our kids weren't so young, we would probably move to Colorado. I, I fell in love with Colorado. We only went once, and we're, like, in love with it. In love. I've never been there during the winter, though. And I'm in the Bay Area. Oh, cool. So you guys aren't that far away from each other, right? I don't know if you've heard me say this, like, a million times, but I used to live in Kenosha. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to add a little bit of water. I think my Regal's okay, but I'm just going to add a little bit of water. You want it to be yogurt consistency, so really nice and creamy. You share to your daughter. Awesome, Christina. Thank you. And those of you guys that are new, we do a giveaway at the end of every live. All you have to do is like and follow the page, um, share the video, and then comment the keyword, which is tagged today, and then hang out till the end. The sound keeps messing up. Yes, I feel so much better, Rebecca. I swear, everybody thought I had COVID or something. Like, nobody wants to come around me. And I was like, it was just a sinus infection, guys. I don't know, but whenever I feel congestion, I instantly take Mucinex and, like, I'm, like, in bed. Because it's, I just, it knocks me on my butt, you know? So I couldn't move because my head was hurting. And the Mucinex helped a ton. All right, so I'm just going to go through this. Oh, Rebecca, your mom texted me and I still, I haven't had a chance to look. But I'll have to go look. The video keeps flipping. You guys, I don't know what it is because it looks fine on my end. Like now that I have them on the same internet, I see it okay. So this is a larger piece that we're gonna do all with the same color. So I am gonna wanna work a little bit faster because it does dry fast. I've got my door open, the AC bumping. So I'm gonna work as fast as I can. Not on my end. Okay, so if you guys are having problems, I would just go in and out and see maybe you just need a better connection because it looks okay on my end too. So in projects like this, I usually do like a paste and peel because the paste dries really fast. And this is one of the things that you just have to learn to work with because it's not like acrylic paint where you have to wait two hours for it to dry so you can move on to the next step. You can do it all in one sitting takes about two to three minutes for it to dry, just depending on obviously how much you have it watered down. Um, if you have like an AC or a heater blowing at you, stuff like that. We don't realize how much the air affects what we've got going on. All right. I'm missing comments. If I miss anything, guys, feel free to just comment again. You had the COVID test today? I heard that it's tough. I heard that it's, yeah. I just had a sinus infection, guys, I swear. Um, so, because it's drying on me, what are you able to hang it with? So, it actually has the little holes in it already, so that you can go ahead. I'm going to pull it up a little bit, and then we're going to continue on. But look at how awesome. You wish it was cold? 
you know, I'm excited for it to get colder, but at this point, I'm kind of like, I'm good with this. So beautiful, guys. So I pulled it up because I don't want this paste that I put first to, um, to dry. So it has two holes that you can go ahead and use, like some twine, some rope, however you want to hang it, but it does already have the holes in there so that you can hang it. Just depends on what, where you would hang it, to be honest. But you can use some, I don't know, fish wire. I'm sure you can find something to hang it up. Um, and we're going to actually glue the front and back together so that they don't move. And you don't get that like wobbly, wobbliness. Wobbliness. All right, let me just do the rest of this. Is, is that a newer purple? It's, um, it's, I don't think, it's been around for a while. It's called Regal. But no, it's been around for a while. But of course, color like this is going to stay in because it's Halloween. So pretty. So we just used a portion of it. I'm going to put it back on its backer sheet and I'll wash this on its, I'll wash this in the bathtub later. But there you have a super quick and easy, dang it, accent um, tag. So I'll show you the holes right now. I'm going to let it dry a little bit more. But you see that hole? So this is where you would find something to hang it. A twine or like a, a thick burlap. I mean, just depends. Do you sell the stuff you make? Um, Missy, I usually don't. Like uh, every once in a while I'll make, yeah, twine should work because they're not, they're sturdy and they're good quality, but they're not complete. They're not like stupid heavy. So um, every once in a while I will sell things, but I mainly focus on teaching really so that you guys can DIY because a lot of this stuff is so hard to ship um, that it's just not even worth it because I just don't want to charge you guys a ridiculous amount of shipping. But look at how cool that is. I love it. So let's say you, where'd you get the tag? Girl, I got it from my shop. Under surfaces, they're door tags that we sell, nine by 12s. Super cute. So there's our accent. We're gonna let it sit. Um, we are making a double-sided door tag. So you guys can, um, if you're just now popping on, you can like and follow the page, share the video, comment tag to get entered in tonight's giveaway. So I'm going to let you guys choose the, the transfer that we put or the design that we put on the top. So we can do this one, October 31st. Yeah, of course. No, Chantel, you can layer it. And somebody had asked, when are the, when are the, you guys vote while I, while I chat. You tell me she, season's creepings or 31st, whatever. Um, another person had asked why we wax or when we wax. That is exactly when you wax. You wax when um, you're going to layer. You can most definitely layer, but you want to wax because remember, these are super duper sticky and you want to make sure that um, it doesn't peel up your paste below. It would be the same thing with, um, with acrylic paint chalkboard paint, any type of paint, because these bad boys are sticky, guys, and they will fill up your paste. October 23rd! I don't have October 23rd. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm totally kidding. Okay, everybody voted for this one. I'm going to do a straight shot color, guys, because I think it'll look better like that. Season, everybody said 31st, so you guys, I do have these coming up in bundles in my VIT group, so if you guys want to do something similar or you want to try this out, Remember, you can put it on anything. So if you have foam board, if you have, I don't know, what else can you put it on? If you have, you just received your kit, awesome. Whatever you have at home, you can put this on. If you like to decorate your windows, if you like to decorate your front door, or whatever you wanna do, you can always try it with that. All right, so it's super duper sticky. I'm gonna fuzz it. Even though, well, let's see. Now I'm gonna fuzz it, because it's really sticky, you guys. It's really sticky. Thanks, Tammy. Thanks, guys. Awesome. Did you try your kit out yet? What kind of wax do you use? So you can use any type of wax, just depending on the store you go to. Verathane, Minowax, they all have it. Um, but my shop also has a surface wax. So it just depends on where you want to go. If you want to go to Walmart, I think, see how sticky it is? Um, I think they have Verathane. Would you also wax foam board? I'm trying to think if I waxed foam board. I actually haven't just came to the door. Oh, how cool. Um, I actually haven't waxed foam board because I usually paint it. 
So yeah, I probably would wax foam board because it's like a paper essentially. So you would want to do a wax or at least a really, really, really good fuzz. All right. So this one's super duper sticky. So that's why I did it so many times. All I'm doing is picking up lint from my towel that is really dirty. Yeah, you guys can comment VIP and you'll get the link to my VIP group. I'm going to put this all the way down because obviously I'm going to attempt to do a bow at some point and it will take up the top space. So I want to keep that bottom space pretty. I, it's super sticky. I just make sure that I get off all these little things that I got stuck on here. All right, so you want to use a clean towel when you fuzz. Good general rule of thumb. All right. And then use your hands to make sure there are no bubbles. No bubbles. But yeah, guys, you can layer and do so many different things. Okay, I think it's about right. I think it's just... Are the tags repasteable or does it stain because it's wood? Um, Jennifer, because it's wood, I would say that it's probably a one-time use, but I have heard people spray it with this. This or any type of poly spray, Rust-Oleum, you can spray your wood surfaces with this, a good couple of coats, and then you can chalk on them and you should be able to remove them. I personally have not done it yet, and I promise I will to give you guys, like, my actual experience, but I have been told that by another leader of ours, that she does that with hers. So I really need to do it, but I haven't, because the smell bothers me so much. All right. Okay, we're going to do Shimmer Shadow, which is a just a glittery black, so it looks like a, it's just so pretty, like it's all glitter, all shimmer this away and we're going to reuse this bad boy. So could you ink to make more permanent? Um, I wouldn't use ink Jennifer just because then you'd have to heat set it some way and I just wouldn't put it outside because you don't know how well it's going to withstand like the elements. So I would poly spray it if you really wanted it. Um, if you really wanted it to be permanent then you're going to want to use paste and just a poly spray to seal it so that you will get the best use out of it. Let me clean this off. Wait, show me, show me the can again. Oh, they're all different, okay? So this is just Minowax polyurethane. They're all poly sprays. So if you just search up polyurethane or urethane, I always say it wrong. But if you search that up, you can find a different brand in the store local to you, in the store next to you, whatever. All right, let me clean this bad boy off. Hi, Barbara. I haven't seen your live yet. I can't wait to go look at it. I'll look at it tonight once I pick up the kids. I was trying to finish early today so that I can pick them up early because I was MIA all day yesterday from not feeling well. All right. I ran out of wipes, guys, so that's why I'm using it like this. So bear with me. There's some somewhere, but I haven't gotten them. Okay. So we're going to use our shimmer shadow now. I'm going to do the same thing just all at once. Oh, this needs water. And those of you that have been wanting these, I have a ton in my VIP group soon. Are you guys all excited for Halloween? Just wanted your opinion. Of course. That's what I do. So I add a little bit of water, guys, because it's a little um, it's a little drier than I'd like. You can tell I've used this one a lot already. Thanks, Nikki. Thank you, Mary Jo. Thanks, Cindy. Thanks, Barbara. Okay, so we just get it to the consistency we want. We want it nice and creamy and not watery, okay? If you spray a board before using paste, do you still have to wax before using the transfer? I guess it depends on what you sprayed it with, Kelly. Sometimes they'll stick even harder. I uh, look, I love the skull. It's cute, right? Um, yes, yeah, so it just depends on what you spray it with. Like if you're spraying it with a poly spray, I would probably seal it too. I mean, I would probably wax it too. And the most important thing, guys, is normally you only have to wax your first couple of uses on the transfer. 
If you're using galvanized metal and it's your very first time with a transfer, then yes, you need to wax. There are some surfaces that you will learn that are just, they, I don't know, they just cling. And then since this is a shimmer color, um, it's actually going to take a little bit longer to dry. So I can take a little bit more time with this. You're ready for Halloween? Everybody is decorating. It's so cool. Guess I will be down. Oh, that's right. Super cool. Love your candles. You may Oh, thank you. You know what, guys? I've had the candle, the actual candles lit for like three days now. Can't wait to see them finished. I know I'm super excited. I wish I could do bows and I would totally do them live with you, but I can't. I gotta go watch a basic bow tutorial and do it. And it was just as you predicted. I was talking to myself. That's exactly what it is. Like, we naturally, as women, talk to ourselves throughout the day. So why can you not go live and talk to yourself the same? Obviously, you got to incorporate other people that are talking. And, like, sometimes the things we say to ourselves are a little bit weird. <laughs> but, yeah. Hey, fun. But that is exactly what it is. So I'm just taking my time, guys, because shimmer paste takes a little bit longer. Because um, the consistency is just different. But it's so relaxing. And see all that extra paste that's there? So watch. I'm going to get this out of the squeegee and I'm going to peel all that paste off. And I have so much paste that I can put right back in here. So when I tell you that everything you use is reusable, it's because you really do get the best use out of this stuff. And I put all that back in there for another project. And if you wanted to make a ton of these and sell them, that's your money right there. We have the best conversations, right? <laughs> I'm sure you did great. We are our own worst critics, pretty much. All right, I'm gonna take this off now. It looks like I forgot something, no, no. Okay, let's take it off now. Make sure your fingers are clean. Ooh, and it has so much shimmer. Oh my gosh, okay, I'm gonna have to put it up close. I love it. So this is just cleaned with water, okay guys? The same water that I'm using in here, I put, I use to clean them, or I use the bath. Let me see. Right? I don't know if you guys can see that shimmer, but let me try to make sure I don't get it dirty. All the shimmer. So pretty. And I think I have extra shimmers that will go with that transfer. You hate your voice? Me too. I hate it. So just so you guys know, I did put it lower because um, I don't know that you guys could even see the shimmer from that, but all she did was talk for me. Okay, so this is dry, right? And this is our accent. I did put it lower for a reason. I know it looks kind of weird because we're going to put a bow here, okay? So now we need to let this one dry, but let's think about the way it's going to be. So this is going to be our main um, fall piece, and this is going to be our accent. So it's opposite, obviously, right? So this is going to be the accent. Super cute. I love it. And you guys, I, I'm not very big on, well, no, that's not true. I love to decorate for the seasons. Like, I love to decorate. But I don't know that I would spend a ton of money on redecorating my home for a season that I feel like comes and goes super fast. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. But stuff like this is so cool because once Halloween is over... You flip this back around and you put it back to fall because it's still fall for a good another month and then you do Christmas. So I feel like fall is like the most popular decorating season and Christmas, of course. Okay, so this is going to be my main one and we're going to do our pick our pumpkins transfer. I should already have one used, so I'm going to pull out my used one so that way you guys have more of those. I should have one used, but doesn't know doesn't mean that I'm gonna be able to find it. Or it's gonna be clean. Thank you, Miss Brittany. Thank you, thank you, guys. And of course I don't know where it is. They're just all the transfers, guys, throughout the season. So like as you grow, you save transfers, and then you, ooh, it's dirty. 
Let's clean it really quick. Enjoy my decorations more when I make them rather than buying them. You, can make you really can. Like, even wreaths, guys, like, if you're into that. I, I wanted to make a wreath for myself. And once I did, I was like, hell no, I'm not doing this ever again. <laughs> but you technically can make them way cheaper. It's just the amount of time that it takes to make them. Am I blurry again? I don't know what it is, guys. It's got to be my internet. I really don't know. I really don't know. Hey, Renee. Thanks, Danielle. Okay, so we're going to clean this real quick. I have a really bad tendency of not cleaning my transfers when I should. Um, but they, they're fine. They're fine, guys. Don't worry. I'm just going to spray a little bit of water. Obviously, when you don't clean them right away, you're going to get staining, and that's totally fine. Um, as long as it's not something that bothers you. So, like, if you're super OCD or you're just super uncomfortable with having the staining, then you want to clean them right away because that will, that will avoid that. Except for, like, super pigmented colors, you might get a couple stains. I think that the internet goes out when I stand up or when I move. My husband threw away one of my board erasers the other day because it was on the floor. That's what I get. Huh? Must be I went in and out a few times. I think it's just when I stand up. So I just put a little bit of water and then we're going to clean it. It's always good to have like a really wet, um, a really wet sponge to help clean, help soak up the paste because that's really all it is, is a sponge. Hey Jane from Waco. Thank you, Miss Kim. So you might notice that some of the staining stays. That's okay with me. Really? And it's still bad? I'm sorry, guys. I don't know what it is. I noticed that it's doing that on my end, but that's crappy. And I tried both services, so I don't know what to do. Yeah, OCG, Yeah, a lot of people are OCD, and a lot of people panic when they see that they're staining, and they're like, oh, my gosh, I ruined it. And I'm like, no. As long as your screen is clean, everything else is fine. And this one I actually did on foam board, which I have over here. I can show you guys. You just need your screen clean. The board erasers are a pack. Yes, Miss Sue, they are a pack of two. A pack of two, and they last you a really long while. And now I'm going to clean the back side. And look at all the paste that came out of my towel. It's still being cleaned. Now you guys get to see how to clean them, too. Of the shorts and sleeves. Oh, are you? I know, right? In some places, it's so cold, and I'm over here in shorts. It's, it is chilly at night, though. It's chilly, but it's not cold. Do you clean the top side first, then the sticky side? Um, so eventually, you're always going to clean the sticky side last, okay, if that makes sense. Because no matter which way you clean, the paste is going to come out. Does that make sense? So you have to go in and out. Really? I'm so sorry, guys. I don't know what's wrong with the internet today. And I actually haven't had any issues in so long. So it looks pretty good. Yes, there's some staining, but my screen is clean. So to me, I'm good. Yep, looks good. I'm sorry. Should I switch back to the other internet or did it get, it got better, right? That's crap. I hate when you guys have to try to watch through all this. I'm going to let this dry really quick, okay? I'm going to let it dry. Let me show you what I did with this transfer. On a different surface that I got from the Dollar Tree. Um... This is just foam board, guys. So it's foam board. I painted this to make it look like wood, and I glued it on to make it look like a cute little frame. Super cute. Added some raffia, and that's it. Are the board erasers like magic erasers? Yes, they are. They're just like magic erasers, but I did try to substitute these for magic erasers, and for whatever reason, the magic erasers don't, they don't last very long. So I... I just stick to these because they last a long time. It did? Okay. Hey, Caitlin. Hi, Precious. 58 in Kentucky. I swear, guys, my AC is on right now. <laughs> okay. Thanks, Caitlin. Okay, we're going to let this dry. 
let's check on our shimmer paste. Ooh, it's still a little wet. I, I'm sorry, as long as you guys can watch for a little bit. I don't know if I should switch or make it, should I make it, I don't wanna make it worse, but I see it going in and out for me as well. Hold on, let me do something. I'm gonna get on my other internet, and if my other, we're all hogging the internet so it's mad, right? We're like breaking the internet. Plus, I've been on, I've been on live since like 4 p.m., so maybe that's why my phone and my internet are like, hey girl, you need to give it a rest. Um, all right. Yes, exactly, Sue. So that is exactly why I stopped using them because like I'm cleaning my transfers and if you notice, I'm not like super delicate, but they would crumble and they would stick to my surface. They would stick to my transfer and they're sticky and I'm like, no, I don't need that. So that is exactly why I just stick to these because they're way better material. All right, so I'm just letting this dry, okay guys? Ooh. If you guys have any questions, let me know. Um, we will have, I think I just sold the bundles for these, but I have more coming up. We'll have a bundle for these and we'll have a bundle for the October 31st in my VIP group. So just make sure that you comment VIP and get the link for that. I think this is good. What do you use to clean the transfer before I purchase one? I use these. I use board erasers. They seem to go out of stock pretty often. So what I tell people is you can use a magic eraser in the meantime, or a green sponge from the Dollar Tree works really good because it has that rough side and that rough side is really what's going to help keep all that staining away. Hi Paula! Alright, I think this is good. We're going to go ahead and put this on here. Remember we already waxed it. Um, I'm going to do orange. How did I do the other one? Orange, green, and black. What do you guys think? Just distilled water. Thanks Rebecca. So an orange pumpkin, green stem, and like, what do you think for here? Just, just black? Do you wax after the paint is applied as well? No, Diane, I don't. Um, I know that there's like, it says it seals it, but I don't because I don't want it to re-wet my paste. If it re-wets my paste, since it's water soluble, it could essentially start smearing. Hey, Cindy! Um, so I don't, I would just spray it with a poly spray at that point. All right, let me get my orange and stuff so we can get those out and get those ready. Orange. So I can do orange or I can do papaya. And for the accent, the accent we're gonna do buffalo plaid. And we can do a different color. There's the two oranges. And then this is the green I like, even though it is super bright. <laughs> it is a big tag, brown or golden words. Yeah, I think it, I think that's good. <gasps> my, my printer, I hope my husband's not watching. Um, I don't know, let's see, I don't know how well, um, I don't know how well gold will show up, but let's see. Thanks, Nicole. All right. So I'm going to work from the top to the bottom just because I probably won't do this all at once. I'm going to do a bright orange with this one. This one's kind of fun. Hold on. I somehow have two oranges. Where do you get the screens? Barbara, you can, you like papaya better? Papaya is a darker and um, orange is a lighter. What do you guys think? Um, was it Brenda? I'm so sorry if I missed your name. Barbara, sorry. Barbara, you can get them directly from my shop. Just comment shop and you can check them out all there. The ones we're using today are pumpkin patch, I think, October 31st. Ah, uh, we're gonna use the buffalo plaid and then we're gonna, and then we used the skull one. Hey Brenda. All right. What am I doing? So I think that, I don't know, darker or lighter? Did you see my comment I just sent you? Um, no, I might have missed it, Rebecca. If you guys ever comment something and I miss it, just let me know. The orange, so orange is super vibrant. Papaya is a little darker. Lighter, lighter, darker, lighter, darker. <laughs> I'm doing some water. Orange. All right, let's do orange, guys, because everybody's saying orange. Okay. Let's do orange. I'm just going to mix them up a little bit. So you want to make sure that you just have them the right consistency because after they've been sitting around for a little bit, they tend to soak up that water you're putting in them because you have to remember these are not, they don't have any chemicals in them. Light. Okay, we're going to go lighter. Oh, wrong one. We're going to go lighter, this one. We're gonna go lighter.
lighter just because think about it be hanging on your door think about it be hanging on your door <laughs> um, the lighter color is obviously going to catch more attention so we'll go lighter this time but you guys can make it darker you like how I threw that in there all right so I'm just adding a little bit of water thanks Danielle I hope my migraines better soon time and time weather has changed here oh so you get migraines from the weather change I think maybe it's like sinuses no that's usually what gets me. Will the sun fade? No, as long as you seal it. And well, I mean, if you're going to have it in constant sunlight, then of course the sun might do some damage to it eventually. But um, I haven't had an issue with them in the front. Because I would make porch signs and they seal and they're fine. From I think we have, we did a class a year ago and they're just taking theirs out. They're good. Hey, Janet. All right, so I think I've got it good. It looks almost like baby food, and that is okay. It's just going to be a little different because there's no chemicals, okay, guys? So when you get weird consistencies, it's okay. These are all dirty. Go figure. Go figure. Can you do two shades of orange? Of course you can. I can add two shades of orange and, like, mix it together. Migraine for three days, girl, for your pain. Yeah. I feel like if you have a migraine for that long, then you've got to go seek medical help, attention, do something, go get some blood work done, go see what's going on, because your body's telling you something. Change set migraines for me. All kinds of things give me migraines. My kids, um, when people don't listen, what else? <laughs> Hot mess, light and dark. Okay, we could do that. We can do that. And that's totally dependent on whether you like, um, you like it like that, you like a clean image, whatever you like. Thanks, Angela. All right, thank you, Miss Cindy. So I'm gonna add some more to our papaya then, since we're gonna mix it together. And you can do this however you want, guys. You can do like one side papaya, orange papaya. You can do ombre, you can do hot mess, however you'd like. This is your creation. All right, I'm going, I'm going to shut up now. <laughs> I'm going now. Um, I'm hope, I'm wondering if this is going to, I feel like the gold is going to be too long. Um, I used to get migraines a lot, Rebecca, but not anymore. I used to get them a lot. I feel a lot of it too is stress. I have sneak metal and for mine a year later, no answers. Really? So when I was younger, I used to get them a lot. And yeah, they would tell me like, okay, you need to avoid all these foods. And they gave me a list of foods that cause migraines. And it was pretty much anything besides fish and, but like cheese, hot dogs, all kinds of things that I was like, what? Like, I can't eat. Can you guys see me? My thing's loading. Damn it. I'm just here talking to myself. Okay, sorry. Yeah, so I've heard that Botox is really good for migraines, um, but I honestly feel like once I learned, I didn't realize the door tags were that big. Yeah, Jenny, Jenny just make sure that you don't get the mini tags and you get the door tags. I love these guys because um, you can get them other places and they're kind of pricey and then they're even more expensive to ship. So I love that I could just get them myself. Okay, um, I hope that I'm not going in and out for you guys, but I'm going to try to make this as fast as possible so that we can get off and not deal with any more technical issues. Am I going to need the black? No. Oh, what did you say about navy? You want to do navy? Oh, with a plaid. Navy for letters and plaid would be cute. Well, maybe we can do navy for the, I don't know. Let's see. Once we put these together and we have our colors. I'm starting to get a migraine talking about <laughs> me too, girl. Me too. That's so funny. <laughs> I hope you're joking though. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. But yeah, I honestly, I don't know. I feel like it's a lot of times it's stress, but I learned to not let things bother me so much. And oh my gosh, it's been a godsend. All right. I'm just cleaning this bad boy because I need wipes and I need to clean them. Hold on really quick. I'm going to get wipes because this is going to drive me crazy. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. I'm going to deal with rest because 
guys. Yeah, if you need sleep, what helps mine is razatripitan. I think I know that's not right. Um, I've heard Botox, chiropractor, I've heard so many different things, but I think it really depends on what you've got going on. Like, what is the problem? Okay, so I'm going to do brown, guys, and then we'll go from there. Oh, you need wipes, so don't leave your wipes behind. I usually use baby wipes, but we're running low on baby wipes, so. I actually let my baby use them. So I'm just going to do the top part, and then I'm going to kind of peel it up, and then we'll work our way down to the pumpkin and the bottom. And then I have all this extra paste. Really? Yeah, I got them since I was very, very little. I don't know what it is. Ooh, yeah, I like how that brown showed up. And you can always do brown and gold if you want to do both. I'm just going to go ahead and put that down. Now we're going to do our green, and then we'll go into our orange. Hey, Chris, how did you make the candles in the back? Um, Christina, we did them with Dollar Tree pool noodles. I do think I, um, <laughs> I do think that I have a video in my on my page you can just go to my videos and you can check them out there it's very repetitive and long so feel free to just um kind of get the gist of it and then you can move on because it was super long i felt like it was really long all right i'm gonna do the green here i liked this green because it is super vibrant but is it hi andrea I'm sorry guys, I'm going to try to make it as fast as possible so we can get off from this crappy ass internet. I'm going to do our hot mess really quick. I'm just putting, I, you're not really going to be able to tell because the oranges are like super close together. But then we're going to just go to town with it. Well, I guess you can kind of tell. I like to have some type of rhythm going with my colors. But the cool thing is, is like, let's say you were to do a hot mess. It will never ever look exactly the same. Um, this green is rainforest green, so I do apologize, but it's not available anymore. I suck. I'm not supposed to do colors you guys can't see or use. So there's a meadow green that is really nice. Because this is more of a, a summer green, really. But I like how vibrant it is. All right. Just need to do this part right here. I blended it just a tad, because why not? Put a little green towards the top. Ooh, super cute. Okay, we're just gonna do the bottom part, and then I will show you guys up close and personal. A little green up here, one mile ahead. I'm gonna do brown, and then I'll do my gold. Thanks, Krista. Thank you, thank you, guys. Thank you, Miss Jody. I have not eaten supper. Oh, I made pozole, but I ate a little bit because I had so much stuff to do. What did you guys have for dinner? My husband and I have tried meal prepping. We did stick to it for a good two weeks, but whenever he's off, we tend to go eat because we're running around. Um, so I've been trying to make, like, I just eat crappy those days. Does it ever go back on uneven after you've lifted it? Oh, like the paste re, re, no, usually it doesn't, but you want to give it a little bit of time to kind of set in so that it doesn't, but usually it doesn't, nothing happens. Once you take it off, you just kind of throw it down there and you're not putting it back down. Biscuits and gravy, so it doesn't smudge and when you lift and lay down. Is that what you mean? Sorry, I might have totally missed somebody's comment. But yeah, so I lift it because this is not like your traditional stencil where you just have an open space. It has a screen. So the awesome part of that is you don't get any bleeding and you get crisp lines and then um, you don't get any blotchiness with your paint. It only takes in what it needs and then it takes the rest away pretty much. I'm gonna use my gold just like that because I'm dangerous. So I love it. But with that being said, you have to learn how to work with it a little bit. So it does dry fast. So you just got to work a little bit better. We had ham and potatoes. Nice. Woo. Okay. Let me put this away on this backer sheet. Oh, 
Make sure you don't get anything anywhere. So all of these need to be cleaned. A little green from the stem of a pumpkin down the pumpkin a tad. A little green from stem of pumpkin down the pumpkin a tad. Oh, like over here? You want to put green on the pumpkin, I see. So I got a little bit of gold paste here, and I just wipe it right off. All right. Then I got a little bit of paste over here, and I just wipe it right off. So that is also a good reason for wax. It will help it. Super cute. And I do have them lower, guys, because remember, we're going to have a bow. So you want me to put green down here? I'm going to leave it over here so you guys can check it out because we're going to work on the accent. So we've got our Halloween on, this, on the back side, our Halloween accent, and then our main fall piece right here. Now we're going to do our fall accent. So we're gonna, I'm going to let you guys pick the buffalo plaid, and then you guys tell me what colors you think will go with it. This pumpkin one is so cute, guys. It really is. So easy and so fun. Okay, so we've got regular buffalo plaid, or we've got mini buffalo plaid. You guys pick what you want to see, and I'm going to put um, some of these colors away. This is so easy, guys. I'm, I can't tell you that I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm so talented. Because it just makes it so easy that no matter what your craft level is, you can do this too. That's why I love it. Because you, if you're crafty, then you can just make amazing things, like just over the top. Regular, mini, mini. Regular, regular, mini, mini, regular. Ugh, it's even, guys. Am I going to have to be the tiebreaker? Navy, orange, and beige. I don't know that I would do so many colors with it just because, remember, it's only going to show a tad. But I like the idea of navy. I really do. Do I have a navy is the problem. The big one. I feel like the big one. Hold on. Hold on. Let me clean this up really quick, guys, and I'll show you. I'll show you it close up on you guys. I think the regular might look better. Probably not gonna do an orange, but let me put, let me do it like this. It's probably the best way to figure it out, right? I do like the navy idea, I really do. Okay, so let's do our mini buffalo plaid here. So you've got your little accent, right? Mini, don't look at this. Mini. Regular. Did that help? <laughs> Did that help now? Sometimes that helps me. Now, if I have a navy, is going to be the trick. Yay, Brittany! Yes, I do. Brown? So we can do brown. We can even do gold, guys. The bigger one, if the smaller one is too much detail. Well, I don't think it's too much detail. It's just, you're going to see more buffalo plaid with the mini and less with this. You know what I mean? So maybe it is, I don't know. So everybody's voting mini. Okay, got it. All right, so let's do the mini. I'm not going to lie, guys. I think the mini is dirty. Don't hate me, but it's dirty. Okay, so colors. This is your navy. We've got brown, we can do gold. Can you show the mini again? Yes. Brown, gold, um, we can do a pretty sage color. Let me show you the sage. Sage is my favorite. So this is eucalyptus or Smaller surface mini is best. Um, or sage, which is really pretty. Brown. I feel like I gotta sneeze. Sage. <laughs> we always go for sage, huh, Brenda? Okay, definitely mini. So my mini is dirty, but I'm not worried about that. Because it's okay. Sage, either brown or sage. Do you guys like the navy? The navy is pretty, but do you think it goes? <laughs> Thank you, jo Thank you, Joy Lynn. <laughs> Joy Lynn. I'm loving that tag. It's cute, right? And it's going to look so much cooler when we have it already put together. Then you put a bow for either season and you hang it. 
Sage, 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 sage. Okay, let's do sage in our mini, in our mini. I think we're done. We're done. Don't say anything else. Okay. Okay, so this is our main one, accent one. Now I'm going to put this over here because it's probably still drying. And then we're going to put this one and we're going to flip it over and this is going to be our accent. Brown or gold. Enjoy fall, fall colors when you can. Um, well, sage is a fall color, don't you think? You guys are making me, oh, you guys always make me question myself. I like it though, sage, but gold would look really nice too, but I don't know that gold would show up that much. All right, we're just going to do sage. sage. Sage and gold, mini, navy, and brown, the glitter color from the arrow. Yeah, Amy, so that's gold. Do you guys think gold? I don't even know why I asked. Just kidding. Okay, so I'm not going to fuzz this one because obviously it's been used and it has some stuff on it. I'm not even going to clean it. Darker green, the sage is a warm fall color. See, right? Sage is fall, guys. So I'm not gonna clean it. It's just shimmer paste. I'm not worried about it because it's going to, hold on. Hold on really quick, really quick. So we've got, we've got it like this, right? And then only a little bit of here is gonna show, so I'm not worried about it. What the hell? My comments aren't going. How much is the Buffalo's? Uh, the plaid stencil is $29.99 retail. But remember, Caitlin, that we had a deal on it. So just send me a message. I had a bundle on the pa Buffalo plaid, guys. If you still want it, I will totally put it up again. Because it was so awesome and there's more colors back in stock. You can get either transfer, the mini, or the regular size one. And they're so cool. Okay. And you guys can use this on anything. I used it on a wood centerpiece that I need. You can use it if you want to add this to a shirt. If you want to add this to a runner for your table, because they don't already have a 15 million. Where did the wood come from your site? Yes, Miss Ricky, you can get them directly from my shop. If you comment shop, it's actually the first link, I think. All right. So I'm not worried about this part. It may not go in all the way but it's not even going to show. Yeah, they're called, um, they're just regular tags because we have the mini tags and then we have those. Hoping for a bundle on Christmas minis I saw. <laughs> yes. Girl, we got to get rid of all this um, Halloween stuff first. Everybody's asking me for Christmas and I'm like, wait, we please wait. Okay, Kathleen, I'll put it back up. So those of you that want the Buffalo plaid bundle, I'll put it back up. But keep in mind that anything that you see in my VIP group and you're like, eh, uh, eh, <laughs> eh, I don't want that. I want this instead. Just message me. I'm slow motion. I'm sorry. I'll go faster. Just kidding. I'm sorry, guys. I'm trying to hurry with this crappy ass internet. I don't know why it's like that. Okay. So I'm just going to add some water. But yeah, I'll put it back up then. Because I did go a little early with the buffalo plaid. And I know not everybody is in Halloween, but into Halloween. Okay. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going really fast. I miss the tree special so sad. Oh, well, they're coming back just separate. I can't wait to get my kit. I know. Mail has been slow, slow, guys, but it's going. It's going. If you ordered mystery bundles, almost all of them are out with the exception of one person, which we'll all have it out tonight. Um, and then everything else. No, not you, the video. Oh yeah, I know. I was just being, I was just being silly. Okay. Let's go real quick guys. If I miss anything, just let me know. So the most important part of this stencil, because it's so big, okay, you have to make sure that you have no air bubbles because it's large. So if you're like, let's say it's your first time and you're like, oh, I'm scared to use it. You could even cut it up if you only wanted to use so like such a big, or such a certain size. You can cut it up to make it fit you because it is a little bit larger to work with. But, I mean, worst case scenario, you ruin it and we just get it replaced for you. It's no biggie. It happens. I ordered the Buffalo check from you and haven't used it. You got it though, right? <laughs> I'm like, wait, you did get it though. And if you guys, if we weren't getting shipping notifications. So like I normally like to send shipping notifications as soon as I have them. 
So I swear I'm not a shitty customer service person. I just didn't get the notification. So this whole time I thought like, oh, they didn't come. Maybe you could do a Christmas DIY once a week so you can get the supplies from Dollar Tree. They're going to sell out, girl? Um, yeah, so in the next, honestly, in the next week or so, I'm probably just going to be doing Christmas, guys. Like, I'm going to Christmas your heads out because I have so many things I want to do. So many things. Awesome. Quickly, too. Okay, good. Yeah, so they've been shipping right now uh, three days out. So, like, all my 10-1 orders, if you ordered around that time frame, they're out or on their way out. I need to pull this up a little bit. I didn't realize that I put the the outing of the tag on the wrong side. Duh, Brittany. I'm trying to hurry because the air is on like crazy, but hold on. I'm going to pull it up a little bit. My favorite holiday is Christmas. A lot of times they sell out here in Iowa. Yeah. All right. So you've got that rustic look, especially from that shimmer color. Looks good. Remember that if you leave spots of the paste in there, it's going to come out in your design. And I totally did that. So I'm just going to lay it down and fix it. Oh, thank you. It's my summer blouse since it's still summer in Texas. I'm always super hot inside. I don't know what it is, but it's because I'm chubby or something. I don't know. All right. I think we're done. So this is a very subtle color. So I don't know... It might be too subtle for some people. I don't mind it, but it is a very subtle color. We'll see how it looks when we put it up closer. Let me move this over there. It's still wet, okay? Um, and I did, like, smear it in some spots. Can you do the plaid, then put another transfer over it? Of course, Mary Jo. All you have to do is let make sure it dries completely um, and then wax it. Just do a quick, low, um, a quick light coat of wax. And that's it. And then you can do whatever you want with it. But especially if you're using these transfers, you want to make sure you protect the paint below. We have this tool, guys, that is freaking awesome. Um, it's a detail tool, okay? So it's got this little toothpick of an end. It's 40 degrees, but it's always cold over there, right? And you just clean up all your little edges, which is what we used to do. We used to get like a toothpick or something or like okay and then I'm gonna use a bigger spot to clean up these spots but since I waxed it guys you can usually get off any little hiccups you make and honestly sometimes those hiccups end up being like magical pieces so you notice how the the shimmer frost pumpkin came out here the outline it's not meant to look like that it's because I didn't clean it but I'm not worried about it because it's going to I think it's going to overlap. Yeah, it should overlap that spot. So if you want to clean it up in certain areas, you can do that with this little tool, which is really cool. Like if you really wanted to do it, but I think it's cool like this. 54 in South Virginia. I should check, but it's probably like in the 70s. All right. Oh yeah, I think it's going to look cute. Okay, I can't do anything with it yet. So let me put my paste away, guys, and we'll start working on our giveaway. Because I'm not going to completely put it together until I do um, some practice bows. But so you can at least see what they look like. So I'll have a finished pick for you guys tomorrow. Give me some time. I just got a really helpful tutorial on how to make bows in my messenger. So I'm going to check it out. And I'm going to see what comes of it. No, we are hot when it's in the 60s and 70s. We have maybe two and a half months of this cooler weather. We can get snow anytime. Definitely want info for the plaid bundle. Of course. Yeah, just make sure you're in my group. It's kind of late, guys, so I normally don't go right away and post things in the group because the majority of you guys are already super duper, like, ready for bed if I didn't already put you to sleep. So I'll post it first thing in the morning, but you guys can always can always claim, claim one. 46? Dang. All right. So yeah, just make sure that you guys like and follow the page, comment the keyword tag, and we're going to do our giveaway while we let these dry. Ashley, I'm going to have to try it. So I got the Bodabra, but I honestly think it's just me, personally, because 97 
It's so funny watching you tonight because your voice and lips are not working together. <laughs> I'm so sorry that you guys had to watch this like that. Tabitha, you can get them directly from my shop. I think your shop too, right? You can get them from the back office under surfaces. So remember guys, if you like a lot of this stuff, your, might, your best bet might be um, considering becoming a designer because you can get it all at 40% off at your leisure. You don't have to wait for me. Oh, I like that, Sammy. Thank you. Okay, let's put these up. We're going to let this dry and we'll start our giveaway. And then we'll put the little tags together so you can see how they will look. But yeah, you can comment shop. You'll get the paste and um, the tags sent to your messenger. I know they're so fun. Yes, so those are the, yeah, these are the door tags, Tabitha. Not the mini tags. We have a frost advisory. No way. You guys are just trying to make me jealous. I'm just kidding, but I'm sure you guys don't like all of that, right? All right, let's start. I think all the giveaways have gone out. Well, all the rest of the giveaways are going out today, tomorrow. Hi, Nina, I know. Nini, right? 76 degrees, it's best. Okay, there you go. So it is 76 here in El Paso, Texas. In El Paso, low is supposed to be 71. Cool, that's actually not bad, right? But I still, still, thanks Brenda, I appreciate it. I'm glad that you guys could, could do it because I wouldn't do it. Just being honest. All right, let's do, crap, I'm going to have to order again or that, no girl, they're in stock. You know that if I'm doing them, they're in stock. Can you repeat the package? Oh, for signing up as a designer? Oh my gosh, yes, Chicago is always cold. Um, or which package are you referring to, Karen? about shining up as a designer. Ooh, I hope you're okay. All right, let's start our giveaway. So, Olivia's romantic home on YouTube. Okay, I will. You need red ink, I know, don't we all? Because it's Christmas. Um, but it'll be back soon, girlfriend. There is no emergency. <laughs> but I'm just kidding, yes, we do all need red ink. All right. All right, I'm gonna start picking some winners. Okay, guys, so how this works, if you're new, I will call out your name, <clears throat> right? Um, I will call out your name, and if you're live, and oh, I know, if you're live, um, let me know you're here if I call your name. And you're a winner. No, Caitlin, it takes practice, girlfriend. You should have seen some of my first lives. They were terrible. And some of the people that are still on, that are people are watching me, still watch me from then. And I'm like, ow. Sorry, it's not working. Hold on, guys. It's not working. It's probably my internet. Olivia Romantic Home. Okay, I'll check it out. Thanks, guys. Hold on. My internet's not working. Hold on. It says I'm offline. Oh, my God. I'm going to try to hurry before it kicks me off. You guys, this was the fastest live we've done in a long time. Birthday is tomorrow. Oh, happy early birthday. It says I can't connect. Shit. Am I disconnecting? Oh, my internet sucks, you guys. Can you guys still see me? Say something. Or did I go? Okay. Started watching me organize. Oh, oh my gosh. I know. So they actually have like the little bundles that you can go buy to start with each room. So I'm going to buy the pantry one, I think, first. Okay, my comments are working now. I'm going to buy the pantry one first, and then we're going we're gonna to do it. So those of you that, um, if you like everything and you're really interested in learning on how to make money with this or how to just sell pieces or whatever you want to do, um, okay, cool. Um... You can comment info and there is a group there that you'll get the information to and I will tag you in the video that I just did today really talking about Paris channel, really talking about the opportunity and kind of things you can do with this stuff. And if you just like to craft and you want to do it as a hobby, you can totally do that too. Okay, cool. I'm sorry guys, my internet went down and I don't know. All right, so Paris Chanel, Paris Chanel, huh? I gotta hurry up though before it does kick me out because it's like super glitchy. Um, Kiara Harrison. Hey, I'm so late. Oh, it's okay. Don't worry. 
That's you can always watch the replay. Your voice and lips have been out of sync for some reason. Oh, it's such a mess. Oh, Kiara's here. Kiara is here. You add me. Yes, I will add you. Just comment info, you guys, and then make sure you check your messenger and go into that group. And that's how I tag you and add you in there. And then also, if you want to just get the deals on these, just go into my VIP group. Yay, Kiara's here. Okay, we're going to pick a couple more people, guys. A couple more people. Bear with me. Bear with the nonsense. I'm so sorry. I don't know what's happening. I'm looking for the keyword, okay, guys? The keyword. I can hear you, but I think the video is delayed. Yeah, it's just a hot mess. I don't even know what to do at this point to fix it besides get off. So thank you, all 170 of you, for actually watching this when it's terrible. I appreciate you guys so much. Even if you just listen to my nonsense. Okay, is this dry yet? Okay. It's pretty much dry. Um, Ricky, Ricky, Leon Nicholson. Hold on, what the hell? Guys are going like crazy. Okay. If I miss anybody and they're on, let me know because the comments are going like crazy. All right, so we've got our Oh, I did the wrong side. Did I do the wrong side? No, I didn't do the wrong side. It goes this way. You just line up those little holes, and then that's where you would put your twine. Also, I'm going to glue this side of it so that it doesn't... There she is. Okay, Ricky's here. Yay! Um, so that it doesn't move or anything, especially if you're hanging it on your door to have them loose and like fidgety, you can totally glue them or put something on them. I honestly think guys, um, that you might be able to even get the paste off of these because it's just, I don't know, they're really good material. So, um, I called Paris Chanel, um, Kiara Harrison and Ricky Leon Nicholas. Um, Mick, I'm so sorry. And Nikki, Mick -tea, Nikki. Let's see if she's on. Okay, so we've got our fall that obviously needs um, a bow and some, you know, embellishments, right? Make it go out a little bit more. You've got your fall. And then you turn around and you've got your Halloween. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> okay, um, let me see if, uh, what's her name's on here? Is Nikki on here? So we can try to get off because the internet is not liking me today at all. But you guys are like troopers, man. I'll have to watch the replay. I know. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It looks cute, right? And so you just add your extra embellishments. If you're super duper um, extra, you can do like a huge bow. I haven't decided what I'm going to do yet. I don't know that I will do a huge... I don't know. We'll see. But it's super cute. So you get the most use out of it. It's not just going to be for like one season. It'll be for two. Did you see the sign I made with the coffee transfer? No, I don't think so, Rhiannon. Did you post it in my VIP group or where'd you post it? What do I do since you called my name? Oh, Ricky, um, you're going to send me your um, mailing address. How much was this bundle? Which bundle? I actually haven't put a bundle up with this one because I'm going to be completely honest, guys. I might be able to, but it might be hard because we used four transfers. So I can do it, but I don't know that you guys are going to like it. But I can do it if you guys want it, most definitely. Okay, I'm going for one more name, guys. It won't go away. I guess I'll just listen. Oh, I'm not doing anything cool right now, I promise. I'm not doing anything cool. I'm just picking names. So we can do a bundle with the tags and at least like a couple transfers or at least one side and I can give you some different options. Hi media, it's okay. You can watch the replay girl. I don't know that anybody's going to want to watch the replay to this video if it's that bad. 
We did a really cool project, but the video is crap. Okay, so I'm just waiting for one more person. Kathleen Holden. Miss Kathleen, are you still on? But it's super cute. I can't wait to put the other little things to it. And then you just tie it down and glue it so it doesn't move. Super duper cute. So this I'll probably sell, guys. Not to, like to be honest, I would probably sell it. Will you glue the bow? Yeah, I'll either glue it or tie it because it has these holes so you can tie it. You can still hear and see me. Okay, cool. Bundles, yes. I love bundles, guys. I'm now a sage lover. I'm excited to see the colors in your bow. You're going to have to, yeah, like sage is one of those things. I think that's why everybody goes for it. Picking names is cool too. Okay, so is Kathleen on or do I need to keep going? Everybody likes sage once you really see it because it really is a pretty color. It really is. All right. Brandy McCoy Caldwell. Picking names. Brandy McCoy. What do you use? Vinyl? Sorry, just started watching. No, Miss Miss Anna, I use pre-cut stencils. So they're like a reusable sticky mesh stencil. Do you have them just plain tags? No Halloween print? Yeah, girl, we have plain tags. Like that's exactly how I have them is just plain. And we added stuff on them. So you can buy them plain and you choose what you want to be your accent or what you want to be your, your main piece. But yeah, most definitely, because I know everybody's not into Halloween. Tie it so they can come off and change it. Do you have, I'm just putting on my Okay, I don't know what bow I'm gonna pick. I like burlap, but then I also like not burlap. Um, okay, so I'm just gonna keep going, guys. We need one more winner. Brandy McCoy Caldwell is not here. And I don't blame you guys for not being here. This was a really, really fast live, guys. And we did something awesome. Proud of myself. Yeah, if you want to check them out, Anna, you can just um, comment shop and you can check out all the stuff I used. Barbara Walker Smith, are you here? Smith. You can check out all the stuff that I use there and kind of get a feel for what what kind of designs we have. I'm going guys. I'm going. I'm sorry. I'm just trying to see if one person's on. Stage with cranberry for winter and teal for spring. Ooh, Mary Current Jam would have looked so pretty, girl. Yay, she's here. Okay, so we've got our third winner. So, Miss Kiara, Ricky, and Barbara, if you guys can please send me your email address. Other than that, I'm sorry, your mailing address, your physical mailing address. Um, other than that, guys, I probably won't be back. I might try to come back Wednesday night. I have been wanting to do Christmas. I'm dying to do Christmas. So just make sure that there's lots of different things that you can do with me. You can just go into my VIP group and just comment VIP and you can check out all my deals. You can shop very small so you can really just start basic and try out the product because you will love it. Um, I have informational videos on how to do it in there um, or you can um, comment shop. You can shop directly without even talking to me, which is fine, but I like to talk to you. Or you can comment info and join the group and we'll chat more about whatever you want or just send me a message, whatever. Okay. Bye guys. See you on Wednesday. Bye. I shouldn't say that because if I don't come on, I'm going to get in trouble. <laughs>